What is up guys? Welcome to the live stream today. Um, thank you so much to all of you who are tuning in. Um, I'll wait a little bit for a few more people to tune in right now. Um, but to you guys already, thank you so much. Today we're going to be talking about that, um, those pictures that I took and how to create that paper overlay. Now you see it in a lot of um, a lot of influencers, Instagrams right now, they're using it a lot. And I thought it was an interesting look and I just wanted to share this one with you today. I found out how to create it. And just as a big thank you to you guys because we're now at um, 30, no, 93,000 subscribers, which is absolutely crazy. I've been saying that all the time. Um, but thanks to you guys, um, we finally made that. And this is why today, once again, I want to share some free overlays with you guys that I created on this paper look. Now let's just check into this look right here. Um, yeah, these are a few examples. Now these two um, are the ones that I shot and the other two are um, taken by influencers um, Josephine HJ and Hannah Schoenberg. Um, they're both from, I think they're Scandinavian, both influencers. And I just really like the look and I got a lot of requests from you guys as well um, about this look right here. So what I want to do today is I've created something right here. Let me show you. Uh, down here, it is that paper fold um, overlay that I created for you, and it's free. As I said, as a big thank you to you guys for always supporting me and just um, motivating me to keep doing these videos. Um, you've been buying those presets. Um, probably most of you guys are getting the all presets pack, and um, that's really helping me to to live this dream and, and this lifestyle. So thank you so much for that. And um, this is why I've created this paper fold um, look for you um, overlay. As you can see here, there are five different folds in this pack um, to just create a little um, different um, style of, of yeah, paper folds. In this case, there's some crosses. Sometimes papers are folded more often. So um, yeah, let me show you that real quick. I think now we're um, almost there. So what we want to do is um, get that pack from the website. The link is under this video right here. So get it for free. Um, open it on your smartphone. And also what we will need is the free over app. So most of you guys who, are been, who have been following my tutorials a lot um, already have the free um, over app. So um, you won't have to download that. But the rest of you should get the over app. And then of course um, all that. You say, oh my voice is... Uh, sounds weird, yeah, it's because I'm in this um, big room and all the doors are closed, so there's some echo. Um, yeah, if it's, I don't know, if it's too noisy, I can try and put a shirt over the mic or something like that. Um, I, I've been trying this from, from the new um, house for the first time now, so yeah. I hope this is not too loud. I can turn it down a little bit. Uh, maybe that's better, um, but yeah, just let me know in the chat. And then we can start and I'll show you how to create those overlays. So I haven't been hearing back from you, so I guess um, the voice is okay. Now let me just play this here for you guys. So what you want to do is, of course, go over to that free overlay app right here and then hit the plus down there and then create an image or upload an image and then what you want to do is go to all photos and then just choose the image uh, that you want to use where you want to overlay those paper looks now we can do it with um, this one right here that i took of nasia and then you hit image again on the bottom left side and now you choose one of these overlays they're gray once you download them and then they're just going to be on top of your picture, you just zoom it until it fits. And then down there, you just scroll over um, to where it says blend right there. And then the blending mode, you want to choose hard light right there, which is, um, yeah, which just kind of makes it all see through. And now you can already see that effect on there and just pull it in the right position. And it already looks super realistic to me. Um, looks like that real paper fold look. I love it a lot. And um, yeah, they're for free on my website. So you can save that picture. Grüße aus Stuttgart. 
Grüße zurück aus Barcelona. And ja, um, yeah. then this picture is saved. Now we can try it with another one. So upload an image again. Now in this case, maybe for um, the guys who are watching, this effect also works on um, male pictures, of course. So I took this one. I chose this one of Justin, an influencer from Germany. And again, we're gonna select that paper overlay that we want to that we want to use. We're gonna drop it on top, and you can see how it's now on top of that um, picture. Once again, pull it and um, zoom it until it fits on top, and then just pull over to blend and again hard light as the overlay. And you can really see at that bottom part right there how real it looks. Um, there's that kind of reflection. It really looks good on the dark spots in the picture. It really looks like real paper, actually. Um, so yeah, I love it a lot. Um, yeah, hope you guys do too. And I've created five of these in the um, overlay pack, so you want to check that out and um, just play around with it a little bit. You can also pull down the opacity if the effect is too hard for you guys, but I think the opacity at 100% is the best now let's take a look at um, these two pictures right here that we've created and i think we can really see how there is that um, paper fold um, on nasia's face on the right side and also then justin's pants um, where the dark spots are um, i think it yeah really 100 comes through it looks real and it really looks as if it's reflecting there um, as if it's i don't know you probably Depending on your age, you probably also used to buy magazines with the centerfold posters and then hang them up in your room. I used to do that um, with Nelly. Thank you, Nino, so much for um, sending five euros here. Thanks for supporting uh, this chat. Um, you really wouldn't have to, but of course, um, I'm really, <laughs> really happy. And also, Nino told me just before we started this chat that today is the Apple keynote. Um, which probably most of you guys are watching simultaneously or have been waiting on that today. So thank you even more for you to you guys for uh, tuning in to, to my live stream today. Um, really means a lot to me. was kind of stupid to time it exactly with the Apple keynote, but yeah, I didn't really check for that before, but I will definitely do that next time. Um, yeah, any one of you has um, problems or, or questions about the, the over app and, and the overlays, um, let me know. Once again, uh, right here on my website is the paper fold overlay pack. And um, yeah, now here, if you have questions about it, um, I'm in the chat now. I can answer to all of your questions. Once again, thank you, Nino, so much for five euros we're gonna um for all the great filters yeah thank you so much for for all the support as well um definitely gonna um yeah invite you on a coffee for that uh next time we see each other and um your voice is lagging yeah i don't know why but i think it's the room actually um it's just i just moved here this is the new place in barcelona and it's not really furnished yet all the way so there's a lot of room for echo and um, the sound might not be um, too good, so please excuse me for that, but I think I'm gonna work on that. I put a carpet in the room and everything to, to kind of get it better, but um, yeah, probably, obviously not, not uh, perfect yet. Your voice is gorgeous. Thank you so much, Mehmet. Uh, greetings from Barcelona to wherever you are right now. Yeah, any more questions from you guys regarding this pack that we've talked about right now? I can also go through the video once again for you. Um, for example, Alicia White, you just tuned in, um, probably haven't seen the tutorial yet. So I'll go through that um, once again. But before that, to everyone who has already seen it, who's already been watching for a bit, are there any questions that I can help you with right now? Also. Throughout this live chat, maybe you have some ideas. Um, I asked you guys on my Instagram story um, about what I can do, new videos, idea, new video ideas. Um, you told me that you're interested in poses, for example, so I did a video on that for you. Um, anytime you just have new ideas for new videos, because I don't want to give 
um, you the same thing all the time, all those editing videos. I will be continuing to do those for sure, but just to freshen it up a little bit, if there's anything new that you have in mind, maybe, I don't know, maybe you like reaction videos to specific videos or something like that, um, I'd really be happy to hear your ideas. And um, I missed everything, can't believe me, okay. So I think while you guys are thinking about new ideas or questions that you have in general, we're going to go through this pack um, once again. Now, right here, first thing you want to do is go to my website and then um, just download this free paper fold overlays uh, pack that I created for you. There are five um, fold overlays in there and I created this for free for you guys once again as a thank you for hitting those 90,000 subscribers on YouTube and just pushing me every day uh, motivating me to keep doing these videos and also just enabling me to live the way I live right now um, so that's a huge thank you and the least I could do is um, just try to create new and interesting free content for you guys um, yeah every day or every week at least. So yeah, enough said. This free paper fold overlay pack is what we need right here. And um, once you have downloaded that, the next thing you wanna do is get the free overlay, overlay app. Most of you guys already have it since I've been working with it a lot on my um, YouTube channel in, in my videos. So you need those two things, the free overlay pack and the free over app. So. Once you have that, what we want to do is go to um, the Over app. I'll show you right here. And um, then we want to open the picture that we want to edit. So hit the plus on the bottom, then just um, go to image, all photos. And now what you want to do is just choose the photo that you want to create this effect with. Um, yeah, in this case, I really like this black and white shot that I took of Nasia here in Barcelona. And then hit the check mark and hit the plus again. Image on the left. And now you want to overlay one of these gray um, paper overlays that you've just downloaded um, from my website. And then just zoom them in and just place them so that they cover the whole picture. And then on the bottom, scroll all the way over to where it says blend. And then you want to scroll all the way over um, until you get that hard light blending mode and now it's actually done you can already see the effect applied now you can turn it twist it do whatever zoom in zoom out um, until you like it and then you hit the check mark on the upper right side and um, yeah then it's ready you can export it on the upper right side as well and um, I'm gonna do this to another picture now again because um, it's not only for pictures that um, that are I don't know, pictures of girls so I've also did an example of a German influencer um, yeah a boy who is really into fashion so again choose your image right here this one Justin is his name and then hit image again on the bottom left and now you can choose another one of these five um, overlays whichever you prefer and then it's going to be on top of that image again now you just pull it and place it to the until it covers the whole picture again blending mode to hard light right there and um, yeah basically that is it um, there you see the effect applied again you can just um, pull it to where you want it and it works best on the dark spots on the pants right here you can really see the reflection and I think it looks super real on that so um, yeah that's just something um, a little tip I'd say so if you have dark pictures or maybe even pictures taken in the night with the flash on um, where there's a lot of black in the picture these effects um, yeah these overlays work really really good man you're the goat thank you so much Francis and um, once again this is I know I'm repeating myself all the time, but I just can't say thank you enough to you guys. About a year ago, I just wouldn't have thought to to be able to live like this now. I'm just doing YouTube at the moment for you guys here in Barcelona. Um, it's absolutely crazy, and this is all because of you guys. So really, thank you so, so much. 
Um, as I said before, the least I can do is do these free overlays for you guys, this free content, and just create, create, create for you guys. Um, I really enjoy it. You guys seem to enjoy it. There's, it's a huge motiv motivation to see this community growing as it is right now. Um, so, yeah, just a big, big thank you. And I don't want to hear any more thank yous from you guys because really I'm the one who has to thank. And, um, yeah, I just hope you have fun with this effect and you can really boost your Instagram, get a more professional, more creative look to your pictures and maybe even engage with more people, get a bigger following and, and just use these presets that I create for you guys and the overlays as a tool to, to get where you want to go, to become more creative. And of course, anytime there is a new idea that you have, anything new that you see that inspires you um, and you think I can help you with, let me know. Feel free to DM me on Instagram, at Stephen Womack is my handle. Uh, most of you guys already follow me on Instagram. Thank you so much for that as well. I really enjoy to, um, to create content for you guys on Instagram as well. If I upload pictures and I see all of your comments and um, I see all the likes that I get, that's super motivating to me. And um, yeah, it's just, yeah, I don't know what to say. This is why I'm doing this live stream today to talk to you guys live and really tell you face to face, face to chat in this case. And um, yeah, just let you know how I feel. Um, yeah, I think we went through this twice now. Um, most of you guys should already um, know how it works because we've been using the over app a lot. Now, I will also create a video of this separately from this live stream on YouTube for you to just go to and check back if you forgot something. And um, yeah, just to get you settled to work with this um, free overlay pack on my website. And for now, I think let's just do some, I don't know, five to 10 more minutes. I'm just gonna be hanging out in the, in the stream here and um, looking in the chat, just talking to you guys if there's any questions that you have or as I said before, any new ideas in general that you have for new content that I can create for you guys such as maybe reaction videos or um, unboxing videos. What, what I also thought is to, to go more into mobile photography since I've been using high quality cameras a lot and um, I totally understand that most of you guys um, don't own high quality cameras or D DSLR pro cameras because they're super expensive. So I thought mobile photography could be more interesting for you to you guys. And um, yeah, maybe uh, in terms of that, maybe also do unboxings for the new iPhone 12 or something like that. And then just testing street photography, um, outfit, portrait photography with these new tools. Let me know what you think about that. Um, yeah, I'll go check the chat for you guys. I don't know if there's let me just check the chat here if there's something got hung up or not. Oh, now I get it. Okay. So iPhone photography is something that you would be interested in, um, as I can read here. Also, I asked you on my Instagram before um, about um, new ideas, and, and I got a lot of um, feedback from you guys also doing vlogs or something like that. But I wasn't sure uh, because actually my life here in Barcelona isn't as interesting yet. Or maybe it is, I don't know. Um, I just wouldn't know what to show you on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, and I don't want to, I don't know, bother you with things that, like what I eat for breakfast or anything like that. Um, I really want to just help you improve uh, your skill set, your Instagram, your photography game. And um, that's why I thought vlogging could be something for the future maybe. Um, but for right now, it's just about... Um, helping each other out, um, showing you things that I've learned in terms of photography, mobile photography, um, things that I've learned 
um, experiences that I've made and um, yeah, just share them with you. And of course, if you have something for me, I'm always open um, for your requests. Actually, want to see how to create clean or natural tone and the tips of color tone in Instagram page. Okay, so that's a question that I get a lot as well as how to create a harmonic feed on Instagram. And I think that's super hard to do because I myself, um, I think everyone just doesn't feel good about his own feed because he's just seeing it a lot and he's... Um, thinking about it a lot and um, once you do that you just get used to the feed and you don't like it as much anymore you always prefer someone else's feed and I think that's super that's totally natural um, the only thing I can can say is that there's a great app called Unum U-N-U-M and um, that's a, a tool that you can an app that you can plan your feed with um, which I do a lot and that really helps to not mess up your your feed with a new post that doesn't fit in which i we can take a look at my instagram real quick because i feel that i've done that i kind of messed up the instagram uh with the last post right here um what i didn't like about this was that it looked super clean and harmonic but then i just just banged in this black picture right there and it just didn't really fit because all this was super bright and then here this black picture comes in also um, the timing isn't really good the location because i'm standing more or less in the same way right here as i'm standing right there so yeah that's that was something that i oh, you couldn't see it right here so this is what i was talking about this last post right here um it just kind of messed it up because i have this black post right there and before they were all kind of bright all harmonic and then i've just posted this on top of another picture where i'm standing in the more or less the same way um i should have posted these more parts apart so this picture would have been maybe here in the middle could have looked better i guess in terms of um symmetric um or, or things like that but yeah that's the way it is um, I have to live with it and I think it's going to be fine. Just keep posting and um, don't care too much about um, your feed because also one thing that I have to say is that a lot of people, including myself, we care about our feed too much and um, forget that most people don't see your whole feed only if they go on your Instagram page. But what most people will see are the, the, the pictures themselves. When they scroll through their um, explore page or just through their home site, they will only see one picture of you and the other, the other pictures of the other people that they follow. So chances are uh, quite low that they will see your whole feed. So rather make sure, sure to really create um, really nice single shots um, of your pictures to make them more interesting. So once they scroll, through their homepage and they see a picture of you, they really um, engage with the picture, like it, or even comment. Um, that's what I've found out so far. And also a little tip to get more engagement um, in general on your Instagram posts, more likes and also just more attention is if you do those carousel posts. So the, the ones that, um, I don't know, you know them, where you can slide to the right, just where you can post more images and then have like a slide post. Those are the ones that are working better for me, um, to be honest, because I don't know, it's just, it tells a story. So you, you just, I don't know, people will stay there a bit longer because they will scroll to the right. Instagram will notice and I don't know, the engagement overall will be higher. That's what I think and that's what I, um, what works for me. And also a super good chance right now is I've been pretty low on that actually is Instagram Reels. A lot of people do that now. Um, you all know it, I'm sure. But it's a really good chance to um, get to get seen, to get a to grow your following quickly right now because there's not as many people that are doing it or, uh, yet. So it's a big chance for you guys to dive into that and be some of the first ones to to create the the content 
um, the reels, maybe think of new ideas. There's a lot of things that probably haven't been done yet in reels um, where you can really tap into um, uh, n totally new areas uh, and really drive your engagement and your following up. So yeah, that's what I could share in, in terms of Instagram growth and um, yeah. That's that. Let me check. Actually, want to see how I saw the Simon feed, which is really clean. Okay, the Simon I, is it a Instagram page or can you send me the link and I'd be happy to check it out and see how what you mean by by really clean. Uh, okay, so you want to see a tutorial on how to pose. Um, on the pictures that I created in the how to pose tutorial um, you want that filter um, preset video I'll definitely I got a lot of requests about that if we just check it out real quick right here internet so you mean these right there um, a tutorial on, on how to create this preset I will gladly do that for you because I've just created these yesterday so um, definitely I can definitely help you with that um, create a video for you this week and also include a preset in the all presets pack that most of you probably already have um, so that you can just use this preset and um, go for that red dark moody kind of fall look it's perfect for fall I think and um, yeah maybe drive your engagement uh, that way. All right, guys, it's been almost half an hour now. Um, thank you again, Nino, for, for sending five euros here for supporting uh, this first um, live stream from Barcelona. Uh, means a lot to me. And of course, thank you, all you guys, for um, tuning in today and spending that time with me instead of uh, with the new Apple iPhone uh, keynote that was today. It's probably still going on. I'll tune in as well. And what do you think about doing more live streams? How do you like live streams in general? How do you, um, would you like me to do uh, live streams more often? Maybe every Tuesday or every Sunday or Wednesday or something like that. Um, just let me know, maybe in the comments under this video or if some of you are still in the live chat. Um, just let me know there as well and um, tips and more tutorials definitely there will be more tutorials coming for you guys in Spomen I want to tap more into that fashion um, fashion inspiration game as well because I'm really I really like to to dress and take pictures for you guys and also it's a big part of creating content of course so yeah why not sounds good and Enjoy the rest of your day wherever you wherever you uh, are watching from Germany Europe day is almost over um, Asia probably middle in the night uh, right now but the USA um, enjoy the rest of your day thank you so much for watching I hope I'll see you in my next video um, either it, it'll be a tutorial or another um, something bigger going outside not just editing or a live stream i'm always happy to see you guys and once again i'm going to leave you here midnight in asia all right um good night then in asia and um yeah i'm always happy to see you and i want to live leave you with a huge thank you for subscribing for supporting and just for for making this journey uh, so special and um motivating me to to go on um, all the way from LA. Good afternoon back and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks so much. Take care. Stay healthy. Stay creative. Peace.